Hello and welcome to the What's New in Freak Dev for August 2020. In this episode we will talk about the newly implemented uh, Pi menus uh, present in the Link Stage 3 uh, branch from Real Thunder. The improvement starts with a powerful new command called uh, Standard Command History, which offers a context menu that can be brought up by using the keyboard shortcut RR. R stands uh, for Recent. This menu holds the recently clicked, uh, clicked to the toolbar menus and actions. You can control the maximum numbers of items with preference, um, general command history size. To create your own personalized uh, menu, simply click, click the Add Toolbar menu action and it will jump to Customize Toolbar di dialog. And prompt for a name of the toolbar. After confirmation, you'll have a new global toolbar right away. But uh, we want a uh, menu instead. Simply uncheck the toolbar item to hide the toolbar and assign, uh, and assign a shortcut. In one of the latest builds, uh, Real Thunder has exposed the um, change workbench commands to the Pi menus and we can uh, easily create a workbench changer Pi. You can now bring up the menu using the chosen sh uh, keyboard shortcut. Another really convenient way to add uh, voices to your pies is to use the type to search bar. A really interesting addition is the shortcut uh, GG to bring up the Peak Geometry menu, which allows you to select the higher order geometry feature than the, uh, the mouse uh, uh, cursor. This menu action is previously available through normal right-click menu. It is now available through keyboard shortcut for more uh, convenience. Use the mouse wheel to scroll if there are more than 8 items in the menu. The wheel scroll is in steps of 8 because uh, it is easier to remember menu items by their position. To scroll in steps of 8 uh, give, uh, gives fixed uh, item positions. To scroll single items use control plus wheel or just drag your mouse. The menu offset will be remembered, so the next time you bring up the menu, you'll see the offset. You can opt uh, to use a traditional style menu by simply right click. Once you activated any item in the traditional style, your choice will be remembered and the next time you bring up the menu, it will be in traditional style. To see the pie menu again, simply select the show pie menu item in the menu. Hitting the Pi menu shortcut twice will conveniently reset the Pi in its initial order. 
you don't have to move your mouse all the way to the button to click just move the mouse uh, to the corresponding uh, direction and once you see the blue highlight indicator you can click to activate the item for items with submenus move to, uh, to the range and uh, it will automatically show the submenu you can configure to hover trigger radius you can opt to activate the non submenu item by hovering more customizations are available in the preferences dialog under display user interface voice we can change the icon size for the pie menu we can change its radius the trigger radius the center radius the font size and the trigger de uh, delay Thank you and I'll see you in the next episode of What's New in FreeCAD Dev.